Hi everyone, welcome back. I'm out walking on my own. It's just uh, after Easter. I'm in a different part of the forest that I usually forage. I'm just wondering if I can find some spring mushrooms. So we'll see what I can find today and I will show you as I go along walking the woods. This is a nice quiet part of the forest and unfortunately there's no mushrooms around so the hunt continues for the mushrooms I just found some candle snuff mushrooms it's like the burned out tip of a candle look what I found a clump of uh, ink cap mushrooms Wow, so nice. They're all clumped together. They're growing on a mossy a silver birch tree. And this type of ink cap are your glistening ink caps. Um, I don't think you can see the glistening cap of it. But normally when it's young, or actually here, this white specks there, those are the ones that gives it the glistening feature these are edible but it's better left behind I never tried this mushroom but there are better more safe mushrooms to eat if you go out and forage unfortunately I couldn't find any edible spring mushrooms but it's been a nice walk very nice weather today uh, I'm gonna show you also a uh, part of a video and I found some old uh, chicken of the woods and I hope to see you again in my next video thank you bye bye look at what we've stumbled upon Just found this big chunk of chicken in the woods. You can still see the orange color from the top, the white flesh. And we're now into spring, so probably this grew over winter and it came from here. It grew from here. Now, this is a big one. One of your tastiest mushrooms, edible ones. Good video. So if you remember this, guys, this is from my old video where I showed you the very young chicken of the woods. So it grew from that corner of the tree. So this is your fallen tree and this is a beech tree. So it really grew quite large and this is a part of the chicken of the woods quite old so I'm hoping it's gonna grow again this autumn and I'm so excited for that